Hey guys, welcome back to Online Shopping with Kim. I just want to show you all a quick DIY of a project that I did in my kitchen. I got these plates at, it could have been Crate and Barrel or Ikea, but it was some time ago, so forgive me if I've forgotten. And I really wanted to display, display them without um, looking too tacky. And the plate stands wouldn't have been the ideal thing. And the other plate holders, I was worried about the damaging the painting on the rim. Now, a lot of people think that hanging plates are kind of like old fashioned, but it's not. You can just look up a lot of videos where people are still hanging plates, and I wanted to hang these plates. So I decided to do some research, it took me to Amazon, and I found this cool product here. That I thought would be perfect because I wanted the plates to look like if they were floating. So these are them. The adhesive, you see that will shine. Now, the thing about Amazon is that you can actually go and check out reviews, which is what I I do quite often. And you know, some people were saying that in the night they'll hear crash and plates fall. And now these plates are not. You know your grandmother's china that are real old and vintage but i still didn't want them to crash so what i decided to do is double up in security so i bought a tube of e6000 also on amazon and i followed the instructions on the packet for the e6000 and i followed the instruction for this product as well and stuck them to the back of the plates now remember that it's a commitment that you're going to make when you decide to use this product that it's going to be permanent fixture. So I let it rest overnight and I gave it a really strong bond which I was really happy with and cleaning the plates after which it has not been a problem. So my husband kindly installed three hooks because I didn't really want it on the wall and this part of the cupboard was even bare. And the beauty about these plates is that it is not so intrusive. I mean, a few guests come and they don't even notice that it's there. So I put them back up on there and I think they look actually really great. They really look like they're floating there. Oh, I have a light kind of above it so it's casting a little shadow now. But it's a really great idea if you want to utilize your plates and the thing about it is that because of its location so close to our living and dining you can change these out to anything you want you can have christmas plates easter plates uh create plates we fall depending on the season in your country yeah and you would have a lovely floating display of the plates that you love so I just wanted to do this short little DIY video to show you exactly how I got my plates to be hanging on my cupboard. Thanks for watching.